co-organized by the Hong Kong Special Administrative Region Government and Hong Kong Trade Development Council, the 14th Asian Financial Forum, AFF, welcomed more than 66,000 viewers from over 80 countries and regions. The two-day virtual forum ran around the clock across time zones and featured a star-studded lineup of speakers and more than 160 influential policymakers, financial experts, business leaders, technopreneurs and economists. They examined the current economic landscape and explored global business opportunities. Themed as Reshaping World Economic Landscape, a discussion of driving global economic recovery topped the agenda. Nobel laureate, economist and policy entrepreneur Paul Roma offered his insights on the topic. Asia no longer was in the mode of simply catching up with the West, catching up with the United States. 2020 was the year in which Asia significantly outperformed Europe and the United States. As it moves into this era of being at the lead, innovation, true innovation becomes more important and harder. Innovation and technology are the engines of financial advancement and were a key focus at this year's AFF. Two technology trailblazers, Alexis Ohanian, founder of 776, and Luke Julia, co-creator of Siri, shared their insights on investment and innovation. The global pandemic was a wake-up call for a more resilient future and put sustainable investment under the event spotlight. Our heavyweight speakers emphasize the importance of incorporating environmental, social and governance ESG considerations in investment decisions and brought scrutiny to the long-term prospect of impact investing. More investors are also here to diversify their portfolio and to improve uh, the risk management. No doubt, ESG is a real game changer in the financial industry and is here to stay. Within pandemic, what we've seen is investors have shown increased interest in impact investing. They want to understand what the opportunities are and how they can engage. And I think that's the real opportunity for us in the field as practitioners or finance professionals, is how do we turn that interest into action? The AFF connected investors, project owners and startups from around the world through virtual exhibition and the deal flow matchmaking session. Over 600 investment projects were presented and more than 700 one-on-one -on -one matchmaking meetings were arranged. These exchanges and discussions shed light on the actions necessary for a better and more prosperous future. You know, it's very good to have meetings like this where people come together and talk about these issues, about technology, the financial sector, and both the profit opportunities they provide, but also the broader social effects that they'll have. So it was a great meeting, and I, I'm, I think I'd be happy to participate in another one like it. After 14 years, the AFF has become a mainstream international financial forum, uh, always at the beginning of the year, so we are able to afford our participants an opportunity to feel the pulse of the world. <laughs>